Salutations, everyone! Welcome back to Crusader Kings 3. I'm Lord Farmed. It's still here in the Realms in Exile, the Lord of the Rings mod, as the Golden King. So, we have pretty much subdued the desert to a large degree. The rest of our mission here to subjugate near Harad is to control Haradwaith. And Haradwaith, the problem is, though, does include Gondorian territory. I don't believe it includes anyone else's. Oh, it does. These guys right here. So I need somehow to get that land. But if I invade them, Sauron's likely to defend them. So we're in a bit of a... We have a bit of a problem. I've got to figure out a way to beat the United Kingdom. And they have significantly better troops than I do. So, hmm, I think we're going to have to build up our forces a bit more before we can do much else. The other thing is to mess around with these guys, which I don't think we need to, although it would be nice if I could bring them under my control. So anyway, let's get going, see what's going on in the world. We have a potential rebellion that just stopped. Always a nice thing. Now, I'm wondering if, rather than, say, invading this faction over here, if we have this, we need to get Court Grandeur to 6 to convince Dijur territory. So, let's work on that, actually. We are going up, so we should hit that fairly soon. Warlike Court. Hmm. At some point, we'll finish off these guys, but it's going to take a while. Oh, low durability artifacts. I don't want to lose these. They're part of my uh, work grandeur management plan. Uh, nope. Apparently, oh, I'm out of money. That's why. Let's get some more, get it reforged, get it repaired, all that great stuff, and then I can worry about mess of Gondor and stuff. Oh, I'll take 240 gold, though. Okay, artifacts repaired. Sauron is still our rival. Great Grandeur is still slowly going up. What's this one? We don't care about that. Someone should do something about the plague, but I don't really care that much about it. Capital is functioning. Everything's getting upgraded there. My subjects have some decent strength, but they're not as powerful as I'd like them to be in the long run. Just make sure I'm, I can get some religious unity going. Huh. Interesting. Can't for... Oh, he is of my cult. Duh. For some reason, I thought for some reason he wasn't. My bad. Um, Let's see. Whoever is ruling here follows the wrong faith. Whoever's ruling here also follows the wrong faith. Okay. You guys don't aren't my direct vassal, so it shouldn't be a problem there. Okay, that's that faith. This area is just an unbelievable mess. Of different faiths, different beliefs, different craziness. To follow the right faith, please. That way I don't have to keep getting involved here. The irony is if they all follow the one faith, they, the ruler would probably have significantly less revolts. 
you are of the right faith. I really shouldn't have to be doing this, but apparently my subject is failing miserably at converting this region, so... In the end, I have to meddle once more. How many of these will convert? It will be very interesting to see. We might be overwhelmed with all the pop-ups here in a moment. I don't think I've got a way to do a mass conversion, no. Not easily. Boy, how did all these people come to power? They must have, like, swapped faith somehow. Okay, I don't even have to click on the profile page. I can just do it all from right here. Even more efficient. Seriously, how did all these people join the wrong faith? All of this took place right under my rulers, uh, my governor's subject vassals, governors, lands, and he had no idea what was going on. I don't trust him anymore. He should probably lose his head for this, but we won't kill him off that for this at the moment. Okay, that should be all of that. Let's see how many pop up I'm going to get coming in here. We'll go into debt a little bit just to bribe these people. Hopefully this will stop those revolts. There we go. Hopefully that will be most of that problem under control for now. As long as they don't all convert away again. Ah, oh, that's nice that I always get some money out of that. Old corpse. Yes, of course. Um, tax relief for the moment. Person may attend us. We are almost to six. Then I'm going to attempt to get them to give the land back, assuming that this person can do his job properly. That way I don't have to mess with Sauron. It's just Aragorn and all his allies that I'll have to deal with. Apparently, though, one of my buildings finished. How is this culture doing in general? It's moving along. It's not particularly efficient. We are significantly behind Gondor and even Mordor, which is ironic in terms of uh, development and culture, even. Who knew Mordor had a culture, right? Okay, Erdan, Goldolf, Aglarin. There we go. There we go. Court Grander has now hit six. There are no valid targets for this task? Huh? What about this province? Seriously. Really great if I could pull this guy to my side. But the different religion and different race is You're crippling. Hmm. Oh, this is interesting. This guy revolted? Huh. Very interesting. The guy didn't really revolt. He attacked a tributary, which is causing his lord to absolutely crush him. 
I haven't seen that one in a while. Uh, reinstate the steel hand. Whatever that does. Mercenary higher cost down. Okay. We need to definitely strengthen these men at arms even further. The old Kai seemed to be our best option in all in all honesty, but still the Gondorian men at arms are superior, as are the Elven. The only thing that's not is the old Kai and the Morgul Whites. Not entirely sure how to deal with this problem. We already control some land up here, which interesting that doesn't help much. Okay, some more taxes. I suppose I could theoretically appoint a vizier to try and make more money. Who would I appoint though? I guess my tax collector. I assume all my vassals are being taxed. Huh. Let's try appointing a vizier. I can always get rid of him later. And then it got immediately replaced by somebody else. Okay, we get an increased available tax jurisdictions. And that's good, because we weren't taxing everybody. Okay, find tax collectors. Uh, search for tax collectors. There we go. We got some orcs, too, which in the long run is a better group of tax collectors. Uh, let's put... him down there. There we go. Saves significant amount of money because we weren't taxing everybody. Unfortunately, I now have a Vizier to deal with, but hopefully he'll stay loyal. We don't have to worry about it. I don't care about a goblet. I do care about inheriting land I don't really want, though. Oh, that's a decent looking thing. Let him deal with all of that. After all, he doesn't have much money and he doesn't have a lot of troops, but we'll let him deal with ruling the unruly deserts. Not entirely sure what to do here. Until... Okay, here we go. Defending against Sauron's claim for the Riddamark. Should I... I can't offer to join because he's my ally. We're invisible against the background, but I can't join him. I can't ally him. What do these odds look like? Fairly even. I think I'll wait a tiny bit. And if Sauron starts to win, which he probably should now that he's got some better men at arms... Then I can, um, uh, let me just quick sway this in my favor. Then I can invade Gondor's southern region. I should be able to do a huge holy war for Harondor down here. Yeah, because I don't need that southern part. But I need more piety, okay. Apparently I have a claim on some of their lands. Okay, so I need to make piety fairly quickly. Is what can I do to get more piety? I suppose swap this guy back to promoting religion. Hope we get an event or two. 
in some ways, hope that Sauron wins the war. Why are you trying to create an independence faction? There we go. There's our increase in cash. Now that we've got the extra tax collector, we're just fabulously wealthy. Should have done that earlier. Okay. 52, yeah. Hard to tell with clans. It really should give me a better indication I'm losing money. Okay, 29... We've been rejected by our cat. That's not abnormal. Sauron is winning. Gondor is in retreat for the moment. Hmm. We still don't have enough piety to launch a huge war. I mean, we could take we could take a duchy, but we need to take a kingdom. In all honesty. I'd say they're in the middle of a big fight. This guy keeps creating an independence faction and leaving it. That's not a good sign. Okay, Sauron is going to win. If he takes out Rohan, or the Vidamark, that will help a lot. Except for the fact that I can't invade Gondor. Still, a loss of 10 or 12,000 troops would be huge. Technically, if Sauron takes the land in the south, I should be able to make him request. Request he give land to me. I still need that one province. Okay, I can't attack Aragorn yet. Let's attack that guy to at least polish off this corner. Hopefully, we can either we can win the war before Sauron shows up. Or else he won't show up. Either way, I hope that's the case. And it, we're just going for the single province here. So far, Sauron has not joined. But enemy allies are joining. Yeah, that's fine. Oops. We have an independence faction by somebody who actually hates me. Ah, it's a dwarf. I can't mess with him. Uh, we got somebody who wants to be on the council. Um, sure, you're actually quite competent. This guy's got council rights guaranteed. And I can't change his obligations. How lovely. Okay. Let's smash this army and the war. Then I can worry about Aragorn, because we should be getting fairly close to enough piety. Get back here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did he just move through me? That looks like he just moved through my uh, army. Matrix level dodging there. Okay. Once we take this siege, the war should be over, which is all we need. Okay. War over. Perfect. That's all we needed. Now we've united it in the east. Now we just have to take it in the west. Mordor won. Wow, that's big. Sauron has been flipped. 
And apparently the woman stayed in charge here, but she was forced to convert to the cult of the lidless eye. I'm good with that. What I'm not good with is the fact that I don't have the ability really to attack Aragorn. Although, on the other hand, there's still this war raging under the mountains. So that's two of his allies who wouldn't respond. Not worried about him. Do we try it? We don't have any holy orders. I need more piety. He has money, meaning he can reinforce. We might just need to wait till Sauron does more stuff. The fact that Rohan fell is huge. Massive shift in our favor. That drastically weakens Gondor. Now we just need to figure out... I suppose I could... Well, never mind. I don't even need to. He's getting annihilated by my subjects. Perfect. Sit back. Let your vassals conquer your enemies. Always a good thing. What's next? One gold. Waiting, 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 waiting. All I need is one silly piece of gold. There we go. Two more to go on that one. Shouldn't take too long. Between the Olkai and the Nazgul White, we should definitely have enough troops to equal Gondor's men-at-arms, if not their levies or their allies' lands. These guys are just getting absolutely wiped out, which is great. Fall of the last of the Umbarians, although the, now the Harondorans, I guess. Need four more territory. Whoops. Oh, we need another tax collector land, I guess. Will you stop creating these independence factions? Seriously. Oops. We just inherited something. That's odd. No, that's that's the one I have in my capital. Which one did I inherit up out oh, there? It is. I suppose I could give that to somebody. Or upgrade it. Once I've got the money, it might be worth me spending the time and effort to uh, fully upgrade that area. Okay, um, old Kai. Built up. Oh, it looks like actually they're likely to splinter the Haran, Haran and or Haran, Haran de Norlands should split pretty soon. We're not gonna call those. Ooh, legacy. Um. I guess a renowned name. Okay, well, that's going to be it for this one. Not a lot of progress towards beating up Gondor. Although, he, he's losing to Mordor. So, I think... Oh, he attacked him. I think we should invade Aragorn next episode. See you guys all then. Bye for now.